Hello, this is Nick from Laptop Media, and today we will show you how to open the Asus ZenBook S16, UM5606. To gain access to the internals, you have to undo 11 Torx head screws. If you are brave and careful enough, you can pop the bottom plate by raising it in the speaker cutout sections and then pry the sides with a thin plastic tool. The other method is to pry the top two corners, pop the rear with a lever tool, and work your way around the sides and the front. There are two dust filters for the ventilation grills on the inside of the bottom plate. This laptop has a 78-watt-hour battery. To remove it, pull out the connector from the motherboard and undo the nine Phillips-head screws that fix the unit to the chassis. The capacity is enough for around 14 hours and a half of video playback. The result is very good given the high-res OLED display and the powerful CPU. To achieve that, you have to apply the power efficiency preset in the Windows Power and Battery menu, select the standard fan mode, and use the dynamic refresh rate option in the My Asus app. The memory is soldered, but at least you get up to 32 gigabytes of LPDDR5X, 7500 megahertz in dual channel mode, which seems plenty. We can also have a look at the RAM modules. The Wi-Fi card on the left is also soldered. For storage upgrades, there is just one M.2 slot compatible with 2280 Gen 4 SSDs. The pre-installed SSD is covered in foil with a long thermal pad on top. The thin vapor chamber cooling comprises two fans. Some of its other components are also visible like the pair of heat sinks.